Hey guys, welcome to the second match between Refrigerator... Actually, can I color swap? Nope. Bef between Refrigerator and Tendo Draco. Tendor Draco. This is Infested August Grad. Which actually love these kind of lovely colors. Upper left corner we have a refrigerator, starting as the uh, hot pink Terran. Upper right corner we have Tandor as the light pink. Pro or sorry, did I say Terran? Protoss. Protoss and Protoss. Refrigerator immediately scooting out that initial probe to go ahead and grab. The and Tandor is not up for this. He doesn't even know how to grab the neutral command centers. So anyway, let me go ahead and read some of the. You can, by the way, you can you can uh, get this map from Dead Infested if you want to play amongst your friends. And I think there might be a Season 3 eventually. I'm not sure when. Fortunately, Refrigerator already outsmarting his opponent. But just to let you know um, how all this works, Unclaimed Neutral Infested CCs, they're just, you can grab them with just any unit of yours or your own Infested Command Centers. Um, Protoss and Terran, you start with one Overlord. Uh, each Infested Command Centers, uh, whenever you... Uh, Whenever you're controlled by Terran or Protoss, it spawns an additional Overlord every 30 seconds. And they're limited by uh, supply... Basically, it's limited by the amount of supply depots you have there comparatively. So basically, you get free Overlords that spawn occasionally as Protoss and Terran now, which can help with vision, which is, I guess, a little bit... And I guess you get that detection bit, which can nerf detection as a problem. So, so we see one spawn right there for Tandor. Um, but... Uh, that way, Zerg doesn't get that inherent advantage just by you grab this or you grab latent overlord. But previously, there's just an overlord alongside. But basically, Terran, Zerg, or sorry, Terran and Protoss need supply. That's a way to get them supply. Looks like Tandor are actually catching up in the overall grab. So he's got two infested command centers. He actually might be able to get another. However, Refrigerator, by the way, in this match, sneaking in a little bit earlier. Gas being grabbed much later. Refrigerator, ooh, needs to get those probes moving in there. He's got two probes he thought he had selected on gas, but they're actually not mining. Let's see how long it takes him to realize his air. There he's moving in, but that was critical lost mining time. Already sending this infested command center down. Um, but yeah, so it looks like, yeah, there's a kind of a ratio between supply depots as far as the limit. So if you have four supply depots, you have five overlords, three supply depots, slash pylons, four overlords, two, you get three. So basically, however many, oops, didn't mean to zoom in right there. Uh, however many uh, you have, you get like one additional Overlord with, to a maximum of five. Um, apparently, if you lose all of your Infested Command Centers, an additional com Infested Command Center will spawn after si after 60 seconds. Uh, so that's also good to know. Refrigerator making short work in this match, by the way. Oh, don't group them up! Oh, that was a huge mistake. Tandor... <laughs> <laughs> realizing his air immediately. Dropping down to six probes. Ugh. Uh, there's also a YouTube video that maybe I should... Uh, there's GG. There's also a YouTube video I should share that has some micro tips. Um, and apparently these players do know where the neutral command centers are at the beginning. It's, uh, it's shown on the map at the start of the game. Uh... Yes, and I think that is it. If you guys want to hear frequently asked questions, you can... Nah, I'll just skip it. Yeah, I think that's it. Yes. Yes. GG's. Refrigerator moves on. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for listening.